somebody that is here. Merciful Lord, we are happy as Calabari people that what you expected has come to play today. Merciful Lord, we lift up your name above all other names. Father, with you, all things are possible. Indeed, today we have seen all your possibilities, especially we, people of Calabari. Now we can travel by road from Degema to Krakrama, from Krakrama to Minama, from Minama to Mekwama, from Mekwama to Angulama, even to Abonima, leading to Portaco from Degema. Father, your son has not even under there, he has also awarded the contract. From Emoha, also to Kaba Kingdom. Father, commit him to the hand. And pray, O oh God, you will continue to bless him. Bless your son, the governor. He has done what nobody can do. Thank you. That you will be alive. Order to see the commissioning of other projects in River State. Thank you, blessed Redeemer. Cover us with the blood of Jesus. For in Jesus' precious name, I pray. Our, Lord, our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us those. I forgive those who transgress against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thou is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. A louder amen. 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 Your Excellency, yes, sir, is the one we came. Commander of the Order of the Niger, Grand Service of River State Life Venture. Governor of River State. Your Excellency, Engineer Sheikh, Governor of Oyo State, and our special guest, Your Excellency, Dr. Mrs. Epalibo Hari Banigo, DSSRS, Senator elect of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Deputy Governor of River State. Your Excellency, Sir Simina Lai Fubara, DSSRS, Governor elect of River State. Your Excellency, Professor Mrs. Ngozi Odo, DSSRS, Deputy Governor elect River State. The Right Honorable Kui Owaji Bani, DSSRS, Speaker, River State House of Assembly. Chief Dan Obi, DSSRS, Vice Chairman, South South Zone of the People's Democratic Party. The Chairman, PDP River State. The Chairman, Elders Council, PDP River State. Chief Ferdinand Alabraba, DSSRS. Distinguished Senators and Members of the National and State Assembly. Members of the State Executive Council. Chairman, River State Council of Traditional Rulers. And all the Royal Majesties and Royal Highnesses here present. Elder statesmen, special advisors, permanent secretaries, chairman of local government councils here present, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the commissioning of Trans Calabari Road Phase 1, connecting six communities to mainland, constructed by the government of River State. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, may at this point respectfully invite for the presentation of Kola. The Calabari Council of Chiefs, led by His Royal Majesty, Disrael Bobo Bob Manuel II, Owukori IX, Amayanabo of Abonima. He will be accompanied by King Dr. Arizad Amos, Onuoya Eken of Degema and other chiefs here present. Other chiefs and traditional rulers of Calabari Kingdom. Right, 
Your Excellency, the Governor of River State. Your Excellency, the Governor of Oyo State, our guest for today and our in-law. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor. Your Excellency, the incoming Governor and his Deputy. Your Excellency, please permit me to rest on the already properly expressed protocols here. Yama Kalabarara Sinte, Omnemi, Yamengba Bagare Bakamo, Omni Bibirge Ipuki. Your Excellency, we'll make it very brief because we know that time is of the excellence. First of all, we want to thank you for the projects you've done in the Calabari area. The last time we met in Abalama, the Calabari monarchs and their people came together and gave you a title, which was Saibi Dokibo, one of Calabar. Now everybody is seeing what it is. Saibi Dokibo simply means he who looks for the good of the Calabari people. We have expressed this not just in words, but in action. One of the roads that has been a big problem to the Calabari people is the road that comes from Emoha to Tema. It's been a death trap. It's been in a complete state of disrepair. But today, we are happy that we have given the contract to completely redo that road to one of the best contractors in Africa, Julius Berger. And the job has started already, which means that you mean business, as always. This project that we are about to commission today, I remember a few months ago, you were here to flag it off with our dear son and elder statesman, the Vietnam and Labra. And you gave us a timeline saying that this phase one will be done and will be completed in your tenure. You have taken the bull by the horn, as always. This is a project that many people run away from for different reasons, some financial, some political, some because they couldn't have the mind and the strength and the presence of mind to do it. But you took it up and you said to us, this project will be completed the phase one, and today we are here. I have written on it and have driven into the, what we, the hinterland now. The persons who are there, who live there, they have never seen a vehicle drive to their place. So today, we have created history again. I've been very well informed because I was not at the campaign ground that during your rally in Akukutoro, you did promise, and you are about to execute, a link bridge from Krakrama to Abonima. Yes, I'm not going to go back. I'm going to go back. I'm going to but I know the Gubra, Obama Korek Wapra. Anya Oko Bewa in Medaka Bay. Anya, I know the Gubrania. I know Gubrania. Excellency. My people have said I should say thank you to you and your recently, for a long time, after you took the bull by the horn and created another first class in Calabari land. For a long time, we had only one in the three local governments. But you came and saw that it was not good. And you gave us another first class. But today, I'm glad to tell you that standing with me are some new first class, uh, second class tools that you have approved and recognized. 
They are my number of people who are here. They are my number of kids here. Those who are. Oprah Ma is there. Edama is here. My number of Edama is here. These are all the people. The amount of of Obonoma is also here. Your Excellency, we want to thank you. We know there are so many now, I can't even remember. Oh, there is Bile as well. Your Excellency, please thank you very much for what you have done for the Calabar people. May the Almighty God give you the strength to continue even after you've left office, to be on our side and work for us. And I know that the incoming governor will not take his eyes off the ball. He has already seen what you're doing. And from his slogan, continuity and consolidation, I am sure that will happen. Your Excellency, we've been here for a while. So let us do our usual welcoming this is what the people are known for in love to their visitors we have three local governments in our area and give redeemer cover us with the blood of jesus for in jesus precious name i pray our, Lord, our father who art in heaven hallowed be your name your kingdom come God will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us those <clears throat> and forgive those who transgress against us and lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For thou is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. A louder amen. Yes, sir. Is the one we came. Commander of the Order of the Niger, Grand Service of River State, Life Venture, Governor of River State. Your Excellency, Engineer Sheikh, Governor of Oyo State, and our special guest, Your Excellency, Dr. Mrs. Epalibo Hari Banigo, DSSRS. Senator-elect of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Deputy Governor of River State. Your Excellency, Sa Siminalai Fubara, DSSRS, Governor-elect of River State. Your Excellency, Professor Mrs. Ngozi Odo, DSSRS, Deputy Governor-elect, River State. The Right Honorable Kui Owajibani, DSSRS, Speaker, River State House of Assembly. Chief Dan Obi, DSSRS, Vice Chairman, South South Zone of the People's Democratic Party. The Chairman, PDP River State. The Chairman, Elders Council, PDP River State. Chief Ferdinand Alabraba, DSSRS. Distinguished Senators and Members of the National and State Assembly. Members of the State Executive Council. Chairman, River State Council of Traditional Rulers, and all the Royal Majesties and Royal Highnesses here present, Elder Statesmen, Special Advisors, Permanent Secretaries, Chairman of Local Government Councils here present, Ladies and Gentlemen, welcome to the commissioning of Trans Calabari Road Phase 1, connecting six communities to mainland, constructed by the Government of River State. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, may at this point respectfully invite for the presentation of Kola, the Calabari Council of Chiefs, led by His Royal Majesty, Disrael Bobo Bob Manuel II, Owukori IX, and Mayanabo of Abonima. You will be accompanied by King Dr. Aruzed Amos, Onuoya Eken of Degema, and other chiefs here present. Other chiefs and traditional rulers of Calabari Kingdom. Right, 
Your Excellency, the Governor of River State. Your Excellency, the Governor of Oyo State, our guest for today and our in-law. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor. Your Excellency, the incoming Governor and his Deputy. Your Excellency, please permit me to rest on the already properly expressed protocols here. Yama Kalabarara Sinte, Omnemi, Yamengba Bagare Bakamo, Omni Bibirge Ipuki. Your Excellency, we'll make it very brief because we know that time is of the excellence. First of all, we want to thank you for the projects you've done in the Calabari area. The last time we met in Abalama, the Calabari monarchs and their people came together and gave you a title, which was Saibi Dokibo, one of Calabar. Now everybody is seeing what it is. Saibi Dokibo simply means he who looks for the good of the Calabari people. We have expressed this not just in words, but in action. One of the roads that has been a big problem to the Calabari people is the road that comes from Emoha to Tema. It's been a death trap. It's been in a complete state of disrepair. But today, we are happy that we have given the contract to completely redo that road to one of the best contractors in Africa, Julius Berger. And the job has started already, which means that you mean business, as always. This project that we are about to commission today, I remember a few months ago, you were here to flag it off with our dear son and elder statesman, the Vietnam and Labra. And you gave us a timeline saying that this phase one will be done and will be completed in your tenure. You have taken the bull by the horn, as always. This is a project that many people run away from for different reasons, some financial, some political, some because they couldn't have the mind and the strength and the presence of mind to do it. But you took it up and you said to us, this project will be completed the phase one, and today we are here. I have written on it and have driven into the, what we, the hinterland now. The persons who are there, who live there, they have never seen a vehicle drive to their place. So today, we have created history again. I've been very well informed because I was not at the campaign ground that during your rally in Akukutoro, you did promise, and you are about to execute, a link bridge from Krakrama to Abonima. Yes, I'm not going to go back. I'm going to go back. I'm going to but I know the Gubra, Obe Makoreke wa Prova. Anya, Oko be wa imere ko be. Anya, ano the Gubra niya? Ano the Gubra niya? Excellency, my people have said I should say thank you to you and your people. Recently, for a long time, after you took the bull by the horn and created another first class in Calabari land. For a long time, we had only one in the three local government. But you came and saw that it was not good. And you gave us another first class. But today, I'm glad to tell you that standing with me are some new first class, uh, second class tools that you have approved and recognized. 
They are my number of FIFA coins here. They are my number of keys here. Those who are Oprah Ma is there. Edama is here. My number of Edama is here. These are all the people. The amount of of Obonoma is also here. Your Excellency, we want to thank you. We know there are so many now, I can't even remember. Oh, there is Bile as well. Your Excellency, please thank you very much for what you have done for the Calabar people. May the Almighty God give you the strength to continue even after you've left office, to be on our side and work for us. And I know that the incoming governor will not take his eyes off the ball. He has already seen what you're doing. And from his slogan, continuity and consolidation, I am sure that will happen. Your Excellency, we've been here for a while. So let us do our usual welcoming this is what the people are known for in love to their visitors we have three local governments in our area and gives up showing that every local government is participating we have asari toro akuku toro and degema um, may i also introduce uh, uh, His Royal Highness Aruzed Amos. Aruzed Amos is a paramount ruler and uh, the equivalent of Amai number in Degema. Here are some drinks to welcome you to our area, to show that we love you. And also, we can't do that without presenting the best of what still comes out of our rivers. In spite of the problems of oil exploration and exploitation, we still manage to find something edible. So we have done that. Here, yeah, these are seasoned crawfish, otherwise known as opro. And then, we have matured fish. It seems as if the people knew that we would be having a big visitor. So they left them in the river. But now they are out. That's what we call Agbra and Juemi. And yeah, Agbra, Agbra and Juemi, Indasuemi, Dorosuemi, those are the native names of some of the fishes, the different species that live in our water. And we only get them out for our trusted visitors. Your Excellency, you're welcome to Calabari Land. God bless you. Yeah. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to give the welcome remarks, may I invite the Chairman of the Local Government Area, Michael John William. Accompanied by the chairman, Bakuku Toro local government area, Nasari Toro local government area. Your Excellency, our dear governor, to our great state, River State. Our illustrious son, the governor of Oyo State, we are using this medium to congratulate you for coming back as the second tenor governor. Our dear deputy governor, our mother, Your Excellency, the incoming governor of our beloved state, the loving governor that is coming to be with us to administer the state for the next four years. You are welcome. I want to stand on the existing protocol because the protocol list is that long. Your Excellency, the local government area is saying a very big thank you. Asaritoro local government area, 
is saying a big thank you. Akukutoro local government area. Your Excellency, we are saying a big thank you. Your Excellency, this is like a Calabari day in the Calabari land. And today, to commission this project, Your Excellency, you invited our in-law, our illustrious in-law, to come and commission this project for us. Your Excellency, we thank you. Your Excellency, what you have done in your channel, the Calabari people are overjoyous and extremely happy. If you swear into human wants, the Calabari people wouldn't have said that do this or do that again. Because what you have done for us is quite enormous. It's so big that the Calabari people are so happy that we can contend with what you have done. But Your Excellency, we want to say a big thank you that today in the history of Calabari land, in the history of Calabari land, these communities have not witnessed a car in their community before. But Your Excellency, today you are introducing that in the land of Calabari land. What else do we have than to say a very big thank you? Your Excellency, we don't have much to say, but want to say a big thank you. I want to assure you, because of these things you have done, recently, the recently passed election, you see what the Calabari people, the love they demonstrated, the love they demonstrated to stand behind you in making sure that you keep their heads above all heads in the country. Your Excellency, we say a big thank you. We say a big thank you. This is a Calabari day. The Calabari people are happy. Your Excellency you can see us in our whites. So the, the cameras are blocking us. But you can see us in our whites. To so tell you that we are happy. Your Excellency, thank you very much. May the Almighty God bless you and lead you all through. I will be behind you in whichever thing you do. Thank you very much. Yeah. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to entertain us with their dance steps, yeah. may I invite yeah. the area yeah. dance yeah. group. Yeah. Yeah. Excellences, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please can we put our hands together for the area dance group.
Thank you very much. Let's put our hands together for the area dance group as a dance out. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, area dance group. Thank you. Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together one more time for Iribia Dance Group. Thank you very much. Thank you. May I now invite to entertain us the OP yeah, yeah.
Thank you. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, may I now invite for the project description the Honorable Commissioner for Works, River State, George Kelly D. Alabor. Your hmm. Excellency, Executive Governor of River State. Your Excellency, our special guest of honor, the Executive Governor of Oyo State, Engineer Sheyi Makinde GSS ROS. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor of River State, the Speaker, River State House of Assembly. Your Excellency, our Governor elect, Sir Stephen Laiu Fubara and his deputy, Professor Ngozi Maodo, elders and traditional rulers here present. Your Excellencies, I pray your leave to leverage protocols already properly established by the compare. Your Excellency, we are here again today for the commissioning of the trans Calabari Road, Phase 1 linking six Calabari communities to mainland, Prakrama, Minama, Sangama, Omekwe Tariama, Angolama, and Omekwe Ama communities. These are communities that have existed for centuries, but have never had access to the mainland. These are communities where if you want to build, you have to use boats to load chippings and sacks and bags and transport. Today, history has been made. Several governments in the past had made attempts, futile attempts, to commence this project. But they were all efforts in futility. You came, you are awarded, and in no time, we are here for the commissioning of the project. Your Excellency, you put your name in the sands of time far as the Calabari ethnic nationality is concerned. Like I always say, let's not forget in a hurry. Before now, out of the 33 towns and villages of the Calabari ethnic nationality, only 12 were linked up to the mainland. Your Excellency, Yensom, Ezeon Wiki alone has linked up extra six to the mainland. Your Excellency, I'll go straight to the description of this project. The crowd is so much so we can't see some of the pictorials here. We'd have been able to appreciate what the road was or what, the, what, what it was before now. There was no road. People will have to go through swamps, 
People will have to pass through Chikoko and mangrove vegetation to access their communities. People will have to pass through a lot of difficulties to access their communities. Today they drive easily. Your Excellency, this is a 13.545 kilometer road in all. We have the main alignment, that's the main stretch of 10.1 kilometers. And we have two spots. We have the first spot linking Sangama of 2.545 kilometers, and that's spot linking to Minama of 880 meters. And so the total length of the road is 13.545 kilometers. Your Excellency, this road project was awarded on the 23rd of March 2021, and we are here exactly 24 months after for the commissioning of the project. Your Excellency, amidst the complexities of the terrain, the complexities of the design and all, this project, I would say, was completed on schedule, although payment for this project was completed about a year ago because the payment method was done through revocable standing payment order, spread about 13 for 14 months. Your Excellency, if we take from the Omekuyama axis, we're going to have change 0 plus 0, 0 at Omekuyama. But I'll take it from the flip side. The bell mouth we have here is going to be change 0 plus 0, 0. And so from here, we have a bridge. And the length of the bridge is 262 meters in length. Now, we have, from this bank, we have four spans. And then from the Krakama bank, we have four spans. And then in the middle, we have three spans. So we have a total of 11 spans. The first four spans from the Degema bank here are measuring 20 meters each. That gives us 80 meters. The other four spans from the Krakama bank is 80 meters. 20 meters per span. Span on the middle is 34 meters each. That is 34 times 3 spans. That gives us 102 meters. 102 and 162 gives us a total of 262 meter bridge from ramp to ramp. Your Excellency, it won't be exciting to talk about the bridge without talking about the construction methods of the bridge. Your Excellency, this bridge is sitting on 92 number 100 millimeter diameter piles driven into ground 21 meters from the seabed. From the seabed, the piles are driven to the point of refusal of 21 meters. From the seabed to the high, high water level is 9 meters. That gives us 30 meters. And from the high, high water level to the pie cap level is 5 meters. So we have a total pile length of 35 meters. Your Excellency, these piles are spread in an array of 11 times 8, giving us a total of 88 reinforced concrete pre-stressed beams. In the first, uh, we have 88 beams in all. In the first, we have 8 times, um, we have 8 times 11. 11 uh, 8 on each row times 11, which gives us 88. Your Excellency, the bridge is designed in such a way that even at low tide and high tide, river crafts can access the navigational channels with ease. And across the bridge, we have, from Krakrama, we have, um, when you move to Chenej um, 5 plus 300, you have the Minama Junction. And then you go 800 milli, 880 meters to the right, you hit Minama Community. At Chenej 6.8 to the left, you have the Sangama Junction. You drive in 2.545 kilometers to the left, you hit Sangama community. And you move forward on the alignment, you get to Tariyama community, and then to Angolama community. The bridge terminates at Chinage 10 plus 100 at Omekwe Tariyama community. Your Excellency, on the pavement, more than one meter of soil substitution was done, and soil replacement was done with sand, and then soil uh, cement stabilization was done, 5% soil cement stabilization, and then we had 150 millimeters of stone base, then 60 millimeter of binder course and 100, uh, sorry, 40 millimeter of wearing course. For the bridge width, we have a total of uh, 11 meters. The, drag, the carriageway, the carriageway is 8 meter by width, and then we have 1 meter uh, walkway and parapet, parapet on both sides. 1.5, 1.5. That gives us a total of 11 uh, 
point, 11 meter width of the bridge. Your Excellency, thank you for doing this for the Calabari ethnic nationality. God bless you. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to give a remark on behalf of the contractor, Lubric Construction Company Nigeria Limited, may I invite the Chief Executive Officer, Gilbert Tassin. Your Excellency, the Executive Governor of River State, Chief Barrister Nesim Ezenwo Wike. CON GSSRS Life Venture. Our special guest of honor for today, Your Excellency, the Executive Governor of Oyo State, Engineer Shei Makinde. Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor of River State, Dr. Mrs. Dipalibo Banigo, DSSRS. The Governor elect of River State, Sir Siminalai Fubara, DSSRS. All others' protocols duly observed. It is with gratitude and pride that we welcome you all to the commissioning of the Trans-Calabari Road Project Phase 1. This occasion represents a major milestone for us, as this is a project that had defied several previous administrations that were unable to deliver on it, and even more importantly, because it holds a special place in the hearts of all in our company. As our founding chairman, the late High Chief Dr. Obi Lulubriks, a patriotic and iconic figure in River State, was deeply committed to this project and the overall progress of the Calabari Kingdom. I believe strongly that our late chairman will be smiling down on us all today with love and affection whilst thanking the governor for having made this dream a reality. Our sentimental attachment to this complex project meant that despite all the challenges we encountered ranging from security to a difficult terrain, we remained unwavering in our commitment to delivering this project and making sure that today became a reality. That said, I must confess that the most critical commitment to which we owe this glorious day was that provided by His Excellency, the Executive Governor of River State. To all those who doubted, disbelieved, or insinuated that this was a white elephant project that would not see the light of day, I must make this open confession before God and man that this project was fully paid by the government of River State way before final completion. I believe this is the first time in the history of River State that a single project has enjoyed such an honor in the midst of competing demands on the government, which we are all aware of, and it has been an honor to be entrusting with delivering this project despite a few months delay. Today is indeed a day of celebration as we open up what might be rightfully referred to as the gateway into the Kalabari Kingdom which we have commenced by connecting the Gema to Krakrama with these bridges and has provided the spring broad connecting Minama, Sangama, Angulama, Omekweama, and Omekwetariama. Finally, please permit me to ask the Calabari people to consider me one of their sons and grant me the privilege to speak on their behalf. Iyama Calabari, Arosinteo, Omiete, Watamuno Boma, Watamuno Miete, Pasisio, Phase 2, Excellency Pasisio, Phase 2, Excellency Meka. Thank you very much, Your Excellency, for this great opportunity to be of service to your administration and the good people of River State. We remain eternally grateful and cherish all the opportunities you have given to us to be of service. This particular project is one from which I have derived great professional satisfaction at a very personal and emotional level. I thank you, sir. God bless the Calabari Kingdom. God bless River State. God bless Nigeria. Thank you. Your Excellencies, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, to give a brief goodwill message, may I respectfully invite Alabo Ferdinand Alababa DSSRS. Yeah. 
Your Excellency, our dear Governor, a very, very dependable leader. Your Excellency, our special guest of honor, the governor of our state, who has again been confirmed by his people that he does require a second term. Our Excellency, our sister, our deputy governor, and senator-elect, Our governor-elect, Sir Simlae Fobra, and your deputy, Professor Ngozi Odo. My dear leaders, I welcome all of you to Calabari land. Your Excellency, my people have said a lot, but I felt I cannot allow this moment pass without adding my voice to the appreciation that you deserve. About 18 months ago, just over 18 months ago, you gave me the privilege and honor to flag off this important project for which we are all gathered today. Shortly after that, flag off. Skeptics were watched on the social media saying this is another gimmick by another governor about a project which has eluded the Calabari people for over two decades. But today, but today, we're all here. to see the realization of that collaborative dream and to tell our skeptics that Governor Wicke is not like any other governor. He's a governor who does not promise what he cannot deliver. And this is what he has shown to us today. Your Excellency, you've done a lot for the collaborative people. And it has been said by previous speakers, that what the Calabaris have gained from your administration had not been gained by, from any other administration since the creation of River State over 55 years ago. <laughs> and it's the same in various other parts of this state. People of River State can attest to the fact that the level of development achieved in their own time has not been achieved before since the creation of River State. Your Excellency, we thank you very much, and we know that history will be very, very kind to you because Calabari people and the people of River State will forever remember you. Your Excellency, I want to make a very quick observation about our people, the Ijo people. If you observed at the last governorship elections, over 90% of the candidates were from our own ethnic group. What does that mean? That it was a position we're all yearning for. By the grace of God, the people of River State have made a choice. of Sir Simlae Fobra. And since then, our son has reached out to all his brothers, giving them the olive hand, olive branch, to join him to make rivers great, rivers State great. Sir Simlae sees his victory as a victory of all of them. And I'll be wondering 
why we cannot take this opportunity to come together and demonstrate to the world that we are indeed grateful people that one of our own is today going to govern River State and we must all gather behind him. Your Excellency, this message to our people has been done in good faith because in the past, this unity has not helped us. They know. This is an opportunity for us to come together, stay united, and demonstrate to the world that as a people, as a group, as an ethnic unit, we can remain strong and play our role in the community of states, in, of ethnic in this state. Enjoy ethnic nationality. You're not the only people. All those who contested, go consensus. I call upon all you. I urge all of you to please join Simla Yefobra. Join him and let us build the river state of our dreams. Simla is not uh, governor of uh, people, it's not the governor of uh, 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 ethnic people. It's the governor of River State. Like, that's a wicked. Then the query man. But see what he has done for us. We're Calabar people. See what he has done for us. And see what he's doing in all parts of River State. So I call upon up up all of us to please join Sir Simla Efobra and let us build the River State of our dreams. Thank you very much. Thank you. Time Governor of Ohio State. Your Excellency, the Deputy the Right, the Honorable Speaker of the State House of Assembly, the Governor elect, and your Deputy, the Deputy National Chairman of our party, South Ambassador Arapaja, the Zonal Vice Chairman of our party, South South. Sudan, you see your be. The single senator of Maradona Piggy and another senator is elect members of National Assembly and House of Assembly over here. Council Chairman of Tegema, Akuko Toro, and Asari Toro Local Government. Chairman of the Traditional Rulers Council and members of your council. I've seen the single senator of Alamari Pepo and John Azota Matan. OCJ Okecha, Senior Advocate of Nigeria. Other members of the Calabari Traditional Rulers Council, led by His Majesty, the Honorable of Abonima, gentlemen of the press, ladies and gentlemen. GDI, GDI, 
we can it can the excellency our dear governor and our in-law let me give this opportunity on behalf of the government and people of the state first of all congratulating you for a victorious in the last 18 March gubernatorial elections held in this country. I was not surprised with what you've done in Ohio State. I knew that the people of Ohio State are intelligent enough to return you back to government house of a burden. I want this opportunity to thank you, congratulate you, and also congratulate our dear daughter. I know she has been praying more than you, and that is why it has come out this way. Let me also thank you for honoring our invitation to come and commission this first phase of Trans Calabari. Again, your wife is from Calabari area, and I thought that now we have completed the first phase, you will come and see it and go back and tell your wife, indeed, indeed, that road has been done and that you treat her better. Now, when everything she asked for now, I give her because she was part of those who are talking to me about this Transcalabari road. Let me, let me also use the opportunity to thank the people of Calabari making up the three local governments for the wonderful performance you showed in the last election. I know over seven of your children were making an attempt to be known. Not that they were making an attempt to win the election. They know there's no way they would have won. But just let it be on record that they have opportunity to appear before Arise News. It's, they were not running to win. They were only running to see that let people know they are there. And I thank you for identifying that they were not serious and they didn't want anybody to take you backward. You, you won very well in Asaritor. You won all the candidates of Cole, of uh, Dumo, of Wenike, of Dadike, of Papaike, all of them. All of them. You won them in Akukoto local government. And you won those two who will always do video. To, to intimidate people, you want them there. The three local government areas, we want all the House of Assembly seats and we want the gubernatorial election. Just like, just like the chairman of Ida's council said about skeptics, I've told you don't bother about those people. People who are not serious think that others are not serious. We are very, very serious. I came here and I said, that during my campaigns in 2014, I said that before I leave office as a second term governor, that I must award the first phase and complete this phase of Transcarbury. People did all kinds of things. They kidnapped the workers of Lubrix for five months. I told them, if you like it, not everybody, this work must be completed. I said, no amount of intimidation, no amount of anything you will do, this job must be completed. To God be the glory, we are here today. Shame on all those people who are planning or who want to kidnap workers, those who don't want good things for their people. Wherever they are now, they must be ashamed of themselves. We are not owing the contractor a dime. We are finished paying. If they did not kidnap the workers, the contractor would have finished this work long ago. But thank God, I praise them for still having that zeal, that commitment to work on. Because some other people would have used it as an example. No, there's insecurity that won't go there. But no, no. And they came, I have completed this job. I did say also 
when the I mean, I was, I was saying, I never promised for Krakaramau. I know when they were correcting you, you were speaking Calabari, they don't want me to hear that one. All we say was from Minama to Abonima, Abonima. Is that, that what I said? That was saying, Minama to Abonima. That's what I said. So I'm an about, it's Minama, I didn't say Krakaramau. And luckily, your son, the governor elect is here. I told him agreement is a uh, agreement. agreement is a uh, one for campaign. Like Toro, I told them that look, they should vote for you. If they vote for you, you will link up Minama to Obama. And I've told them the committee of works to prepare so that we can be awarded before I leave office in the next two months. <laughs> So I'm happy that we are here. And you see how God works. All those people who are plotting evil against us, they are not the ones suffering it. Yesterday, we are to Crown Order to commission the Crown Order Model School. Today, we are here. Tomorrow, we are at Bo to commission the entire rules of Ribibo. Our job ends on May 29. So nobody should say, go and rest. I will only rest after my tenure ends May 29, 2023. So don't think I'm not still governor. I'm still very strong governor for not at that time. So if you do anything, I will prepare you. You see how, you see how I prepare them now? I don't know. Yeah. I don't know what the world suffering it now. Are you say nobody can suspend you? But today he has packed up from the office. We have an acting chairman now. Uh, I told him, you will go, whether you like it or not. You will uh, go. Those lawyers telling you that the world has no power to suspend you is only neck. Then you don't understand. When you came, it was the word that suspended second, is it not? And you went and took off, is it not? It is now that you know that it's only neck. Let me tell you, since they have not told you, the court has struck off that section of our constitution to say that, neck only. So you don't know what you're doing. And TDP did not even appeal the judgment. So forget your own is God. You must be wasting your time. We are ready to battle. We are ready for the battle. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm not from Benway, but I have interest. That interest at IU must go. And I'm going to carry it in May 29 when I leave uh, office. If you, somebody says you won't sleep, will you allow him to sleep? Oh. Will you allow him to sleep? A man lost his unit. A man lost his world. A man lost his local government. A man lost his state. He's coming to preside over we who won our unit, won our world, won our local government, won our state. Something you cannot live where well did not so. If all of us who have lost our own state, what would we be cheering now? You want to use the state to cheer? We are not party to that. Go and bring your own local government. Yeah, we want 32 over 32 House of Assembly, is it not? Are you, how many did you win? Yeah, we want three of our three seniors, not so. Are you, how many did you make? We want 11 out of 13 House of Reals. Are you, how many did you win? Are you, you even lost uh, the money you are supporting for president. You didn't give him the vote. You lost. We, we supported the certain president and we won in our state. For equity, justice, and uh, fairness. So that is all. I'm one of the happiest person. In fact, I wouldn't come to any other to make me more happy. For the man found that the, his word, look at the politician, you will be there, national chairman, your own word will be suspending you. Does he not tell you that you are not on ground? Your own word will be suspending you. And you will go to television to say, only neck, only neck. Stay and wait for neck, you are gone. 
So, our dear governor, I will invite you to come and talk to your in-laws and see whether you can drop anything for us and then commission the first phase of trans Barry Road. Thank you and God bless you. Uh, please uh, be seated. Your Excellency, my dear own brother, Governor Yesam Wike. CEO and, and GSSRS Life Venture. The Deputy Governor of River State and the also at the same time uh, Senator elect, uh, Our Excellency uh, Mrs. Uh, Ipalibo Ari. The Speaker, River State House of Assembly, the Governor elect, uh, Sim Fubara, the Deputy Governor elect, also I came here with the Deputy National Chairman of our party, Ambassador Taufik uh, Arapaja, Deputy National Chairman South. Also, let me recognize uh, the National Vice Chairman South South, Chief Dan Obi. The traditional rulers uh, here, the leaders and elders of uh, River State, and leaders and elders of uh, Calabari land in particular. Uh, let me stand on the already uh, established protocol. Uh, Calabari, over there. Well, I'm happy to be with you again today. And as usual, I bring you greetings from the good people of uh, your state and also from your daughter, my wife, Tamuno Minini Olufunke Makinde. I also bring you news of how things are in uh, your state. On Saturday, March 18, 2023, the people of Oyo State voted overwhelmingly for sustainable development. They said in a very loud voice that they were not tired of good governance, so they gave us uh, four more years. Well, here in River State, I also know that the candidate of our party, the PDP, and the nominee of my brother and friend, His Excellency Yeson Wike, was also voted in. And I'm glad that uh, he just acknowledged the contribution of uh, the uh, Calabari uh, land, the three local governments uh, here, Degema, Asaritoru, and Akukutoru. Well, let me use this opportunity to congratulate the River State uh, Governor-elect, Asim Fubara, 
on his election and to wish him all the best as he serves the people of River State. Well, you know, standing before you is a GSM, and then you have a SIM, and then you have the man with the network. What do you think will happen? No network failure. The good work will continue. Well, we're happy to have the elections behind us so we can continue with the real work our people elected us to do. The business of governance. Well, let me commend my brother, Governor Wiki. You know, when most second-term governors, they've clocked out of governance. My brother is still commissioning projects. And uh, as we were coming inside the car, I asked him, when are you going to stop this your project commissioning? He said he won't stop until May 28th, midnight, 2023. Well, uh, one thing I need to confess to you today is that uh, I told the people of Oyo State that you see how close I am to Governor Wiki. They call him Mr. Project, and his commissioning is working for the people of River State, hoping to continue with that until the last moment of his last day in office. I said to them, if you vote for me, I will do the same thing, and they voted for me. Back in Oyo State, I promised my people that we will also continue to work for them. Some people said, oh, but your uh, first tenor has finished. Let's start the second tenor. I said, no, don't short change me. We still have two months. We have April, we have May of the first tenor. But as you know, this particular project that I came to commission today affects me personally. River State is my second home, and Calabari land my home. This is where I did my youth service some 33 years ago, and this is where I started life. In a manner speaking, this is where I met my wife. Well, you may already know that uh, my wife, uh, she's from Buguma. And so you can understand where I'm coming from. So I feel honored you know, to be commissioning this phase one of the trans Calabari Road. And let me share a story. 25 years ago, I was coming for my traditional wedding in Buguma. And my mother was uh, with me in uh, Port Harcourt. But she couldn't come for that event because she had phobia for water. So I came alone. Uh, I did not uh, think whether, you know, we drowned or anything. I said, look, maybe I just carry the girl, come on, they go to my house. <laughs> but now, not only can you come from Potakot to Buguma by road to Abonima, and now you can go further into the uh, Calabari uh, Kingdom. So I've been told that this 13.59 kilometer road construction is the first ever road access to places like Krakrama and five other island uh, communities in Calabari land. Well, uh, let me congratulate again the people of River State. You have chosen well, and I'm sure your governor-elect will continue the good work. And let me say to uh, Governor Wiki, 
you know, people have been congratulating you and telling you you've done well for Calabari land. I want to say without missing words that you have done well for River State. I've watched you commission projects all over River State. Even me personally, I've gone to flag off or commission projects in different parts of uh, River State. I've been to uh, Equire land. I've been to Equire land. Now we're here in Calabari land. I've uh, been with you where I commissioned uh, the uh, River State University uh, campus at uh, Moa. You've been everywhere in River State. I've seen you go to uh, Ogoni land to commission projects. And when uh, the commissioner for works was making the description of this project, he said when the tide is low or when the tide is high, they will be able to pass under this bridge. Well, what you've done for River State is when the tide is high, all the boats will rise. You have not left a zone or a community behind. So on behalf of Rivers people, I want to say thank you. And also challenge the incoming, uh, the, the governor-elect. When you go everywhere and you bring development to your people, what you're doing is uh, you're stemming rural urban migration. People can stay here and go do their business in Portacot, the state capital, and still come back and sleep in this community. Thank you for the work you're doing. Well, let me again say that in Oyo State, we always say where road goes, development follows. So we look forward to seeing this investment bringing more economic development to this entire area. I thank you once again for having me. And let me say that I'll go ahead and commission this project to the glory of God for the benefit of the good people of River State and Calabari land in particular. I'll say, Omete Tamuno Oboma. Mike. Calabari land in particular, I commissioned this phase one of Trans Calabari Road projects. I do it in the name of God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit.
a construction of Trans Calabari Road Phase 1. Central Group Segment Alignment E, executed by the administration of His Excellency Yesom Ezenwo Wike, CON, GSSRS, Life Venture, Governor of River State, uh, commissioned by me, Engineer Olushe Yabedu Makinde, GSSRS, Governor of your State, on this day, 28th day of March 2023. To God be the glory. The national anthem.